Hello, and welcome to the Synopsys Optical Solutions Group training series. In this video, we will show how to use RAID data files with backward and hybrid simulations in light tools. RAID data files can be a powerful and accurate tool for modeling light sources within light tools. Many LED manufacturers provide RAID data files on their website that can be used in light tools in the place of a geometry-based source model. To use a RAID data file with backward or hybrid simulation, begin by loading the RAID data file into light tools. Once the RAID data has been loaded, look at the source in the system navigator. The source has a collection surface. The collection surface can either be planar or spherical, depending on the data contained in the ray file. The collection surface is the surface upon which the source's radiance is calculated using the ray data. This radiance is then used for backward and hybrid simulations. By default, the size and location of the collection surface is set to completely encompass all of the rays within the ray data file. These properties can be manually changed to reduce the area over which the radiance is calculated. This can be useful when the ray file contains a large number of rays in one region and several outliers that make the overall extent much larger than that of the physical source. The receiver setup for a backward or hybrid simulation is no different for ray data sources versus a surface or volume source. The model shown here consists of an LED collimator, a far field receiver, and an LED source model. The source model consists of a ray data file with 100 million rays. Non-ray traceable geometry of the LED is also included for visualization and alignment. The far field receiver has intensity and color measures defined for both forward and backward simulations. The forward simulation traced all of the 100 million rays from the ray file, almost all of which hit the receiver. The backward simulation traced roughly 25 million rays to achieve a mesh that contained 1 million rays. The forward and backward intensity distributions look very similar to each other. As do the color intensity distributions. In this training video, we have demonstrated how to use RAID data files with backward or hybrid simulations in light tools. If you have any questions or need technical support, please contact us at lighttools underscore support at synopsis.com. Thank you for watching.